Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. It's Vincent and today what I'm going to talk to you all about is the standard aspect ratios for regular digital cinema packages. So these are not for IMAX or anything like that. This, we're just talking regular, standard, 2D, all that. And you've got scope, which looks like this. You're looking at me in a scope format right now. And you can see this is like an ultra wide screen image it looks really cool i think for like landscapes and stuff because you can see like something like the grand canyon i would think in in such a, a level of uh detail that would be harder to see as far as whiff in comparison if you use our other format which is called flat so flat is 185 to 1 and scope is 239 240 to 1 that kind of general size. And so I'll put the exact stuff on the bottom of the screen here for the, the people that are care about the exact technicals. But literally, we have scope and we have flat. And that right there is really your two approved ones. Now, technically, you can also do 187 to 1, which is 16 by 9 if you're talking television. That's very close to... That's very close to 185 to 1 or flat anyway, 16 by 9 is. So you could always do that. But realistically, if you're shooting for a digital cinema, I think you should just pick and, and use one of those two formats. And you can also take like 2 to 1, for example, and put that inside of like 185 to 1 and project that. And some films have done that as well. But really, just, you know, I kind of think it's better just to, if you're shooting for the screen, which I'm not, unfortunately, then, you know, you want to, I think, pick a format that's, you know, designed specifically for that. That way you can maximize your performance. And everybody, this is just a quick video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts in the comments about this. What is the best format? Do you like scope? Do you like flat? Do you like two to one or something like that? As far as ratios go, and thanks for watching. Goodbye, everybody. And action.